Hey, welcome back everybody. It's no secret that I really like the Samsung Galaxy S24 Ultra. It's feature packed and there's a few features that I want to share with you all that really, really make it extremely useful for me. So we're going to open up the Samsung internet. Y'all know, y'all probably know about this, but say you're new to my channel or say you're brand new to the S24 Ultra. So you open up, uh, you open up a web page, right? For example, I'm on this one right here talking about Google Gemini on your Galaxy phone. So you see down here, tap on that right there. You have the ability to summarize, 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 summarize. All right, but you see that right there. Tap on that and you can get standard or you can get detailed. Well, when you get detailed, it gives you a lot more information. And I love how it does it. It does it with bullet points. And it also gives you the ability to copy this information. Say for whatever reason, you're just trying to explain to a friend um, what's going on with Google Gemini getting smarter and with these different extensions and all that then you can do that or say for, for whatever reason you, you don't want all that information you're just going to go standard and boom you're going to go right there and, there's, and let's face it a lot of journalists these days they uh they put a lot of fluff in their articles and that, that is what that is but anyway i just wanted to showcase that real quick right another really cool feature another thing that i miss whenever i am switching phones around and i i switch phones around all the time all right is this right here because i'm always connecting my phone to the Bluetooth in the car is I really miss the ability to use this right here, my sound quality and effects. Dolby Atmos makes a huge difference and the equalizer makes a huge difference on your Samsung Galaxy S24 Ultra when you're playing music in your vehicle or you're just casting it to whatever speaker or, or music system that you're using. This makes a humongous, humongous difference. Another thing that I really, really like and another thing that I miss whenever I'm using other devices and I notice it from a mile away, I want to say this right now, uh, the motion smoothness or the refresh rate, right? This is a 120 hertz refresh rate. This phone right here feels smoother than other phones, period. All right. But <clears throat> say you don't want to use this. You have the choice to go down to standard. You can use that. I've heard a lot of it. I've heard a lot of people talking about they get they don't get that great of battery life on cellular, or maybe they have a a low cellular connection. So I do recommend if you're trying to save a little battery, kick it down to like uh, kick it down to standard if you know if that's what you want to do. Another thing that I think is super super awesome, and I always miss it whenever I go to another phone that doesn't have this level of display customization is i really miss this right here i miss being able to just tune my display the way i want it and that's just so amazing right there to be able to do that and it just looks great you know it just it looks terrific and it's a wonderful thing to be able to do that all right another thing that i miss whenever i'm messing around with other phones is press and hold go to your setting these home screen settings right here this is basically like using a custom launcher. You can adjust your home screen, your app screen, your full, your uh, your folder grid, all that stuff, right? And I, I have a lot of people telling me, you know, they're hoping that uh, the the upcoming iOS uh, iOS eighteen update, they're hoping the public uh, release will actually give them the ability to not just arrange the icons, but to, you know, to adjust your grid. So you don't, so you're not just stuck with a four by four grid or a whatever. You can actually do what I'm showing you right here. You can come over here and you can actually, your home screen grid can be five by five. Your app screen grid can be five by five. Your folder grid four by four. And this to me right there is extremely handy. It's extremely, extremely handy and I love it. All right, everybody. This has just been a few features that I really, really love. I could go on and on talking, or this this video will end up being like 30 minutes long. The S24 Ultra is still the best phone that you can get in 2024. I almost said 2022, that's crazy. Uh, somebody stuck me in the hot tub time machine, I guess. But like I'm saying, this is the hottest Android phone that you can get right now in 2024. The camera system, and you know, I don't even talk about that enough. Like when you really dig into this camera system, all the different things you can do, all of the different settings, it's just, it's amazing. The stuff you can do with this. It's just nice. I enjoy it. Super cool. I mean, the features go on for days and days with your Samsung Galaxy S24 Ultra. I got tons more videos to make about this device. Every time like I switch to another device and I come back to this, I just love this device more and more. 
All right, everybody. Take care and bye.